Okay, unexpected mechanic back again, uh, letting you know what's going on here. There's a 2000 Ford Explorer, it's my wife's truck, 5.0. Uh, I got a radiator leak. So uh, I did some flushing in this car, and evidently I used the wrong type of flush, or it was too powerful the way rust was coming out too much, so I decided to flush the radiator out. And I noticed there was some leaks in it. So what this video is, we've got JB Weld Quick Steel, or Steel Stick rather, Steel Stick. And I've got some right here where the leak was. And some down here, you can hardly see it, but it's on the end there. Now what this stuff does is supposed to stick to metal and plastic and aluminum and everything else. And I've tried it in the past uh, with my Chrysler, and it worked just fine, but of course it's temporary. What I've done is order another radiator, and it's supposed to be here Monday, but tomorrow there's going to be some storms in the area, and my wife has to travel. Uh, to another city and I uh, don't want her to go uh, I mean to uh, not to another city but p part of the county had, either way the, the hills are bad and this truck is better on that so I want her to have a good time and enjoy herself without worrying about sliding all over the road in our Chrysler so I'm gonna put this on here and see if it works and see if it leaks and if it does what I'll do is come back and uh, test it and see what it does and give you a review of this and let you know if you can do this temporarily on the Ford Explorer. I know it works good on a Chrysler. I used it for like almost a month till my radiator came in, but this one I don't think is going to work that well, but I'm going to try it anyway, and I'll let you know if it works. And now I'm tediously plugging, having to screw in the transmission cooler wires here. This car really was rusty. I mean, this stuff really was rust coming out of here. It was really a mess, so that flush did fine. I did a homemade flush kit. I actually used vinegar. <clears throat> didn't have any flush with me, so I used some vinegar, and it worked just pretty good. Let it sit overnight and see what happened. But uh, right now, I'm not liking what I see here. I see some absorption here. Moisture piping up here on this already. But it's nowhere near as bad as it was. I mean, that leak was just pouring out here and down here as well. So we'll see if this JB Well works on the cracks here and see how it does. And I'll give you a report and let you know how it goes. Let me just get this nasty hose wire on here uh, I had these snap clamps on there which I hate so I switched them over to hose clamps here all right so the transmission uh, cooler wires are hooked back up and uh, got the JB, JB weld steel stick on there and we'll see what happens and I'll let you know